What is up, everybody, and welcome back to more Let's Play Pixelmon. So we last left off, we were doing a bit of a gym battle, and um, now we're not do we're not quite ready. I don't think for the second gym. I know uh, we actually probably could sweep it with Grovile, but that's not very fun now, is it? So what I do want to do though is uh, try and level up Shelter a bit in this episode. I do want to kind of take things a little bit slower though, as um oh god um. Um, Alright, so Graveler could totally rock me right here, and um, the only thing is, uh, we, uh, I believe the gym, the, the cap is only like 20 or 25, so I'm kind of really hesitant to actually level up anymore, and um, so let's battle trap in really fast just to get some battle experience down, and um, yeah, oh, okay, so this should let us level up, and um, okay, no, it can't. Um, Alright, so Shelter is really close to leveling up. Uh, what is Shelter's nature, actually? That's something that could be quite useful to know. Uh, as the Pokemon, so he's a bashful nature. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see what this is. And um, as I, as I uh, Google this, I always do this in every episode. You think I know by now? But I don't, sadly. And um, oh, so bashful is a nothing. So he doesn't get any pros, cons, anything. So that's kind of nice, I guess. I mean, it's not a bad thing, really. So. We have a level 19 Trap Inch. I don't think we'll really beat any of these Pokemon, only because we don't have any moves. So, um, let's battle that Numel. Wait, which one's the Numel? Oh, it's there's a Sand Dial in the Numel. Oh, God, we battled the Sand Dial. Mother Trucker. Run. Oh, we actually got away. Damn, I'm kind of impressed, not gonna lie. So, let's try and see if we can push him out. And, um, there you go. Like, giving birth to a baby Sand Dial. So, we're gonna Supersonic and see if we can land that. Perfect. And, um, alright, so now he's gonna start hurting himself, so we can actually tackle, and, oh, that actually did, oh my god, wow, a magnitude of 8 only did that much damage? Jesus. Oh, okay, and a magnitude of 9 did a lot more, so we should be able to kill him right there. Alright, awesome. And he did learn Icicle Spear, oh god. Oh god, alright, so, um, yeah, again, I don't really want to, um, do anything, so he's saying, hey dude, you need to fix something, oh crap. So, uh, let's, let's just get out of here, and he's gonna torment, I'm gonna hit, just continue to hit run, what the hell, pie, and, uh, yeah, so we can get out of here, as, again, I am really, I don't want to, um, I don't want to level up too much, as it will only really cause problems for us in the future, so, oh god, I, we have no health, do we have any potions, by chance, no, we don't, so we could do slash spawn, and then just teleport back really quickly, and, um, yes, yeah, so we could just run over, holy crap, a shiny Dragonair, Wow, and a shiny Gyarados, okay, so, um, that is good for them, okay, if they start throwing Pokemon in front of me, I'm going to get kind of annoyed, you know, just slightly annoyed, and he's gonna say it again, and I'm not sure what I have to fix, but, um, there you go, so, um, hey, oh god, he's gonna, no, no, slash message, killer, and I'll just say that, oh, oh, Okay, so I'm going to go run away. Actually, what is this? What, what was this? Are we out of food, actually? Um. Oh, God, where's our home? We set a home, right? Uh, slash home list. Oh, so this is... Never mind. <laughs> so uh, we do have a few apricorns right over here. And um, so we do have shelter still just following by close on our side. And I can help you with your town if you want. Poor... Oh, so these are all the same signs that were here previously. And we do have the trash can. No, I'm not going to throw these out, though. So we can throw these in here as um, we may try and sell some of those later on. And uh, see if we can't get a better better idea of uh, what's going on. So thankfully, he did learn Icicle Spear. What the hell is that super effective against, though? I really do not know. Um, I, I believe there isn't there a desert. No, that's where we came from. So the deserts would have to be this way. We do have a swamp over there, so that could definitely be good. And... Um, Again, I do want to, we should try and find a potion if anyone's selling any. I don't think, how much money do we have? We have zero dollars. Well, I mean, there's worse things that could happen. Uh, what is the economy basis? I forget. Um, it's been a while. See, that's the only problem with playing on so many different servers. You kind of become forgetful on some of them, but it's okay. So let's see if we can't find something else. Juice, I have a late gift for you. Um, as well, there's a fossil cleaner at spawn, so don't bother making one. See, this is, I should go destroy that fossil cleaner. <laughs> Just, oh no, I flew. I didn't mean to do that. Um, oh wait. Oh, that's why I went home. We ran out of food. So let's go slash back and, um, oh, this is not where I want to be. So we can just go back to it. Nope. Nope. That's, I didn't spell home right and I didn't use the right keys to get to home. So, uh, do we put all our food in one of these chests or something? Um, we put all our seeds in there. We have a ton of iron. Um, but I don't believe, I don't, I guess we don't have that much food. So, uh, let's get into, what the? 
Okay. Um, so let's see. Let's get into the actual thing. Let's get our hands dirty here. And we could destroy the melons. As you could kind of only... I didn't build it. Um, so, oh, wait, that, that is not what I meant to type. So, uh, yeah, we can, we can clear off some of the snow as we don't want uh, the fruits to get all tampered with. And, all right, so we can eat some of these melons. We did get quite a few from that. And, um, let's see, we can just, yeah, we could just really harvest this all. Um, I don't think we need that much bigger of a farm than this because everything we have here, we just all kinds of fruits and vegetables. We want to keep a healthy diet or at least strive to keep a healthy diet. I know that one wasn't fully grown, but... Yeah, so striving to keep a healthy diet, I think that could be one of the best bets. So let's try and replant everything accordingly. So it was carrots, potatoes, and then uh, regular seeds. So let's get that. And we still need to get an item frame. Um, so what, this was here. So we could go plant those all back there. And then these were here. Plant those back there. And then uh, the, the potatoes were on the inside. So we could put them there. And then the carrots were on the outside. And there you go. Beautiful. So, uh, maintaining... Yeah, again, this this farm will would really... I don't think we need anything even remotely bigger than this. This should... It'll feed us and maybe even two of us, honestly. For many, many days to come. And let's... Oh, they should add feeding your Pokemon. They should add a realistic Pokemon mod where you have to feed your Pokemon. That would be awesome. Can I... Oh, wait, what? Um, Sora must really... Um, <laughs> lol. Uh, I think that means like you. Uh, I forget. Oh, what's this? Oh my god. Wow, that's actually really useful. From one RST Grizzly. Huh, thank you. So, let's see. Um, I still need leather. Um, hmm. So I wonder if anyone has... Oh, I can put all the food in here. Oh yeah, I forgot. I have this chest of all the food. Um, I'm not gonna cook that just yet, and I think I'm gonna... What should I use? I think I'll use the bread, and we could eat... Actually, here, let's eat these. And we could keep, we could use the melons for the time being. And I could throw this in there. Um, not uh, sure, why not? Uh, are you going to make a town soon? After I beat the gym. So that's actually something I probably should talk about. Um, I, I do plan on making a town uh, after we beat all of the gyms. Slash flea bags go to spawn. And so we could do slash spawn. And uh, yeah, so we could check out his shiny. I do have to battle something. So we do have, um, oh, a level 17. Savage. Oh, damn. Nice. So uh, we could battle. Oh, no way. Oh, so he has the th triple evolution line there. That's quite nice. And I am going to give away shiny sooner rather than later. And so we got another shelter going o o on over there. And one of these guys, I think would be a huge very very smart addition to our team only because it, their typing is just phenomenal so they are a water and electric type and um, obviously we already have Grovile who is quite good and my phone's ringing let's let's see okay well I will BRB so I apologize about that but I am back now and um hmm well, they all seem to have disappeared now that I left, so we can buy a boat right there, but I don't really want to do that. But uh, they seem to be relatively common. Um, I do want to catch one, and I know they uh, they evolve into a lantern later on, who has a very high special attack and special defense. So that's something definitely important to note. We have a Tom over there, and let's see. So I don't, yeah, I don't know where did they all go. <laughs> there was a bunch over there, and then, um, uh, oh, I just wanted to see pokey and yeah now now they're all they all seem to have been replaced with tentacool and tentacruel so we have an elliot and we actually have glenn oh there's a there's a over there some guy's mining down there it looks like but um yeah so what happened to those guys i don't know what they're called i only know them from their evolution which is a lantern again and um yeah but i think that would really i mean shelter is definitely i don't know I don't know, maybe Shelter doesn't have as good a spot on our team as we originally thought. Um, I mean, obviously for the journey until we complete the team, I don't see any real reason to ditch Shelter. Alright, so there we have one again. My only feel, oh, or is that a lantern? No, this is actually one of the guys I was looking for. Right? Yeah, so I'm going to take a shot in the dark. It's a level 15 Chin Chow. Chin Chow. So, we're going to drown if we try and capture this guy. So let's try and see if we can't get him over to the uh, water. So some guy's saying he'll leave me alone. I didn't know he was following me in the first place, but where did he go? Where did this guy go? <laughs> oh, he's right down there. He's See, yeah, see, they keep diving down to the bottom of the water. And I think there's two right there, actually. Is there? 
It's really hard. Like, I cannot see anything. Oh, yeah, see, there's another one right there. That's a level 20, though. That might be a bit too high level for us right now. And um, let's see. Um, all right, so how are we going to do this? We could probably attack them without killing them. Hopefully. I mean, obviously, we're taking shots in the dark. And all right, so that was close. Let's see if we can't get them right there. There you go. Perfect. So this is the level 15 one we were looking for. If we do a pound, it, a quick attack actually does less damage than pound. So yeah, perfect. And uh, we just, oh God, he's supersonicing me, making this difficult to capture you. And all right, so this is a little close. I'm going to hold off. We can use, let's just try and poke a pokeball first and uh, see if that works. And if it doesn't, then obviously we'll know we, uh, <laughs> we should try like an, we always have an ultra ball to fall back on and all right so waiting waiting grow by <laughs> that's actually pretty funny so this is actually may capture with the first oh i did awesome so we did get chin chow chin chow i i mean isn't there another pokemon chimchar uh no i don't know so he is impish so let's check our nature list right here that we still have open so that increases defense and lowers special attack there, I don't think there could be a worse nature for us to get. <laughs> so yeah, we obviously, we don't want a lower special attack. And he's not a tanky Pokemon. So I think we're going to have to kind of ditch this one, unfortunately. Um, we do have a Beldum over there, which I've still, to this date, never been able to catch one of these guys. And um, yeah, that kind of sucks. Well, I mean, we could go try and capture the level 20 one. But uh, I think this one we got right now. But yeah, so as you can see... What kind of moves does it have? Thunder Wave and Summer. It is Water Electric, which is really good because you could just... It's like a counter to most water Pokemon. And yeah, I don't know. It seems like a really cool typing. Definitely a little bit different. So that's kind of why I was trying to get one. So we can eat a few more. We need uh, like a scuba mask or something to get down there. And um, so we just got to find one of these guys with the right nature. Luckily, they are pretty common. Um, there's a Star You right there. Or is that Star Me? No, it's Star You. So, oh, so there we have a lantern. That's the evolution of it. There is that. Yeah, I really wish there was a, s a simpler way. And I think after you level these guys up, it would actually be um, much easier to... Actually, I got to be careful to uh, not do that. No, I didn't. He just has to load the chunk more. Um, increased it. And all right, so we got a star you there, and yeah, so I guess I'm gonna just kind of hang out around the sides. See, it would be so much easier if I just had a Pokemon to ride on right now, and uh, or even if the water was light, um, hmm, or the wait, the 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 water was light, the water was lit. I mean, and all right, so we have oh yeah, we see tons of Pokemon spawning. I still don't see one. There's a Magikarp right there, and that why is that Magikarp above ground? I don't know. That Magikarp just hanging out up there. So we do have a few of those water stone shards. It's actually making it quite a bit easier to see. And uh, tend to crawls over there. But I don't seem to be able to find any more of these. We saw a whole ton in the beginning right next to spawn. And yeah, right? What, like, am I blind or are there just none here? I might be blind. It wouldn't be the first time someone told me. That. No, not really. Um, hmm. So we have Magikarp, Magikarp. Imagine we found a, ma a shiny Magikarp again. That would be phenomenal. But I don't seem to see any of these guys. So we may have to just settle for the one we have for the time being. We could kind of get a feel for it. And then uh, when we get another one, we could level it up to it. So we could kind of, um, we could kind of, like, keep it, level it up a bit, see what kind of moves it learns, and, uh, you know, see what it's good, or if it, maybe it just sucks, maybe it's not even a, a Pokemon worth capturing, but at the same time, I feel like that's almost unproductive, if we could get one that increases, a, a nature that increases special attack, then, uh, it would be really helpful, hmm, I don't see, all right, so let's see if we jump over this thing, if we can't find one, um, now, nah, these guys are freaking hard to find, Jesus, wait, can we ride them? No, we're not going to be able to. And as it becomes nighttime, I think uh, we may... I, I think that's going to kind of make it 10 times harder. The visibility is just going to decrease exponentially as it becomes nighttime. So I don't know if it's going to be the best bet to go searching right now. Uh, right? Yeah, I don't see any of these guys. Because right now, even I'll, I'll be able to survive even if I start drowning. Oh, wait. Aqua Affinity. I forgot about that. Yeah, I could just get Aqua Affinity. And, ooh, ooh, ooh. So we, we got one right here. And uh, we just got to hope it's a good nature. I'm just worried. Here, let's try and switch into... Let's switch on a Pokeball. 
And, I mean, if it comes down to it, we do have a Master Ball. <gasps> There's a Lapras right there as well. Lapras is another extremely good Pokemon. And it's right there, right? Oh, there's one right here as well. So should I just go for it? All right, yeah, so he's a level 20. Pretty high level, actually. And I, I'm going to battle him. So we have to... Let's absorb, because I'm sure it won't kill him, but it'll do... Okay, that barely did any damage. And all right, so we got a pound, because I do not want to die. And all right, he's going to miss, so we could pound again. And all right, actually, wait, no, doesn't it? Oh, did they fix that? So now I'm above water? Because I... Oh, no, I'm, I'm underwater. Uh... Yeah, I don't know. Okay, please, please capture. Please, oh, well, I'm not drowning. So, that's interesting. I'm going to take a drink of coffee. It's actually Starbucks, believe it or not. Oh, I did capture it again. So, that's... Oh, so they did patch that. That's pretty nice. Pretty nice. So, this... I, I, you could definitely see the defense increase, though. Or, I'm sorry, the HP. The first one has 10 times more HP. So, I'm going to go teleport back to spawn really quickly. That is not how you spell spawn at all. And, we, yeah, so we can teleport back to spawn. Please be a better nature. It's going to be the same nature. Watch. Lax. <sighs> uh, Lantern has extremely high special attack and special defense. That's what it's good for. This has lax decreases special defense. Wow. So, I, I, I lied when I said the first time that there's not many moves that'll be able to screw it up. This is one of those moves. And it actually, what does it increase? So Lax actually only increases, it increases defense. God damn it. Um, finding one of these guys is hard, but I'm dedicated. You know what? I I'm, I'm pretty dedicated to this. So uh, <laughs> is that one right there? I think that might be one right there. It is. All right. Perfect. Perfect. All right. Whoa. Whoa. He just dove down really deep. Holy crap. Oh, he's right there. All right. Come on. We could capture this one. Luckily, they are pretty easy to capture. Please don't kill it. All right, there you go. And, um, oh, he's going to paralyze me, actually. So uh, I'm going to absorb again because it, it did leave it with relatively... Uh, we're paralyzed and freaking uh, uh, confused, so that's never good. But uh, So he's definitely going to be way faster. So let's just try and land... Oh, God, this this is... Uh, lately, though, even on, if you guys watch my Pixelmon Park Let's Play as well, we have been getting, like, crappy, crappy, crappy... Um, not frame rates, uh, confusions. We've just been getting, like, we will get confused, and we will get the full confusion, and it's been happening a lot to me. So, like, if you don't know what a full confusion is, I believe the three turns after is a full, like, you can never get the guy to be, he hurt himself in the confusion four turns in a row, four turns in a row, but you can get it for three turns in a row. So let's see if we could actually get a good one this time. Careful. Oh, come on, please be good. Please be good. Oh, God, I don't even see it. So I'm sure one of you that knows... He's careful. Increases special defense, lowers special attack. God damn it. <laughs> so it's good, but not good enough. I mean, that, yeah. We just don't, I don't want one that affects special attack or special defense. Is that so much to ask for? I'm dedicated to finding this chin chow, though. Like, this is, <laughs> I don't even know if I'm saying it right, but look, we're just, we have three already. We're going through Pokeballs, like, no tomorrow. There's a Lapras down there. I should just capture the Lapras, just because Lapras is a boss. They have a really low capture rate, though. Luckily, these Chinchow dudes, though, they seem to have a pretty high capture rate. So, at least it's by spawn, and there's, oh my god. Look how tiny that horse is. <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. I would almost capture that just for novelties. Oh, damn, look, there's one. There's one right there. And, um, obviously, we can go battle. So, he's a level 20. We should be fine, though. So, we could absorb, um, yeah, wow. Absorbs are good. We, like, we could almost, oh, god. Like, this, one of these guys could totally actually kill us if they really wanted to. And, um, so I'm gonna go for the capture right now. We should be able to do it. Uh, we do have tons of Pokeballs, so, well, not tons, but we have enough. Considering we've caught in these on the first try every time, I'm gonna jinx it now. I know it. But, um... Please just be, what, what, what kind of nature, even if it's a base nature, but anything that increases speed attack, like if we get a modest one, that would be phenomenal. Oh, he, see, I told you, we jinxed it. So I'll actually go, I'll throw the great ball now. Imagine, I'm going to accidentally click on the master ball. Juice said, what rank are you? Wait, what? Oh, <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> oh, yeah, he's, he's like, oh. I guess it was my name's red. And I think we may be... Oh, yeah, we got it. All right, awesome. So, Lapras, I think that Lapras may want to be captured. That Lapras is just kind of hanging out near me. So, this is the final attempt that I'm going to have. Otherwise, we're just going to settle for one. Calm. Oh, okay, so that's good. That's good. 
Increases special defense, lowers attack. That's actually really good. So, um, thank God. God damn it. That was hard. <laughs> That's what she said, but that was that was way harder than it had to be. So I'm not going to get rid of any of these Chin Chows yet in case someone wants to capture one. Um, can, can we do Crane Game? I don't know what a Crane Game is. Um, I know. I, I like how I answer those things in chat, even though, or I answer them like on here, but I don't even know what they are. So yeah, the, the Chin Chow is finally captured. That is going to conclude today's episode. I think we went pretty hard, but we finally found one that we want. And I think, you know, ex exerting the energy was pretty good because now as our team develops and as we grow as a team, actually, what kind of moves does it have? That's something I probably did. Spark, Thunder Wave, Bubble, Supersonic. That's Those are all really good moves because it could take on ba water Pokemon pretty well and it could paralyze them and confuse them. So yeah, really good moveset right now as well. So yeah, I do thank you all for watching. I do hope you enjoyed and I hope we have get an awesome lantern one day. Thanks for watching.